Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 24th, November 24th. We're just going to see whatever comes up. This is not a private reading. It is, you know, for the general public, for all signs, whoever it resonates with. It may or may not resonate with you. We'll see what comes up. What do we need to know? What's going on for the collective? For the collective? For the people that believe? Knight of Swords. Woo! Somebody's coming in? Somebody's coming in. Quickly, perhaps. Oh, with an offer of love? Oh, well, hmm. interesting. May, may uh, affect your independence. If you are single, it appears that somebody could be coming in and it could mess up your singlehood. You know, whoever this person is, they don't want to be alone anymore. That's the way it looks like. Or this could be, this could mean something else as well. This could mean that I don't want to be alone. You know, I don't want to be alone. I'm sick of being alone. I wonder who that's for. Ooh, well, we have the Ace of Wands reversed. There's been no growth in some situation. Maybe somebody is like, you know, uh, I'd rather be on my own because there's no growth. I mean, it could go so many ways. There's no spark. I mean, with Ace of Wands reversed, there's no spark. There's no passion. It's like, what? Ooh. Okay. So somebody is needing to forgive or needing to heal. There's been some grieving, there's been some hurt, there's been some pain, right? Interesting. Hopefully, I mean, this guy's got a sword. If you look down at the end, we already got three. We don't need another one. So, I don't know what the hell that is. Interesting. Ooh. King of Pentacles reversed. Oh, a golden opportunity. Look at this shit. Somebody is getting a new offer of abundance, okay? It's like, okay, so so this is the Nine of Pentacles. Here's the Ace of Pentacles. If you add that, we get the Ten of Pentacles. And because it's reversed, it's actually, you know, an, woo, see if I can catch my cards on fire. And it's actually a... Uh, opportunity to have the ten of pentacles you know a t the ten of pentacles is a family it's a connection it's like a marriage it's a partnership where everything is good you know a lot very abundant secure it's like the happy the happy home life so if you add this to this you get the ten of pentacles and it look and usually in most ten of pentacles cards you see two people you see a family. You see a family dynamic type of situation. So, there's an opportunity to receive something that is very stable, stable, solid, secure. Um, <laughs> and it will bring you additional abundance. Maybe somebody needs to really focus on their coin. Or that's what they are focused on. Or they're, or they're going to receive a raise. Or they're going to receive a promotion. Or they're just going to receive a gift of money. I mean, this is a gift of abundance. And this is something that you can touch, okay? So it's something... This could even be a new partnership. Because I see that somebody's, you know... You may not be single for long if you're single. If you are coupled, you may be deciding, you know what? I want, this is, in, this is one, you may be deciding, you know what, I want to be independent. This could, this is for thousands of people, right? 
Yikes, this is this divorce, perhaps. I mean, this is the justice card reverse. That's that's legal issues can leading to divorce. Could because they there is somebody you know, you know that's the ace of rods. I mean, that's a, uh, you know, go ahead, follow follow that follow that path, and you know you could get yourself into trouble. So, I'm just wondering. Some looks like somebody has. Uh, lost their fire or lost their spark f to stay in some situation that it's not balanced it's not harmonious there's no more growth there's no more passion it's like shit the flame we once had has been put out for somebody and they've probably been dealing with this for quite some time and now they're just they're ready to to mend. They're ready to heal. I don't. I'm. I'm. I don't want to deal with this anymore. I'm ready for my abundance. I'm ready to start over. This is this is uh, standing up for yourself because you may be dealing with somebody who's been really critical of you, and you've been walking on eggshells, and you get to that point where it's like, you know what? I don't care how stable this is. I don't want to walk on eggshells anymore. I want to follow my heart. I want I want happiness. I want things to be easy. I don't want things to be so argumentative, right? I feel, you know, somebody has been perhaps staying in a situation because of the stability of it, but I don't see any love in these cards. There's a there's a new opportunity for love, yes. And this is what somebody wants. I want romance. I want love. I'm ready. I want love. And this night, he takes action. This is the page of cups. This is the knight of, of swords. This knight finds the courage to follow his heart. So we do have somebody that is finding the courage to follow their heart because they don't want to be alone anymore. They may have been in a partnership that is lacking in some arenas. You know, it's lacking a passion. I mean, there's no, there's no, you may not be having sex, okay? There's like no, uh, whatever, what do you want to call that? I mean, sex, you know, it's like they're, we're not even having sex, you know, I'm sorry, but you know, I'm not gonna, you know, pretty this up for you people that are. Children and shouldn't be watching it. So, uh, yeah. Anyhow. Somebody's intuition. We have intuition twice. Somebody's intuition is leading them down a new path. Seriously. To abundance. And it's like God. That's the hand of God. Is handing somebody a golden opportunity. But they may deal with some legal issues. There may be some legal issues involved. If you take this golden opportunity. And this is the hand of God. There's, here's your opportunity. Do you want it? You might have to get single first to accept it because this is getting single. I don't know. <sighs> Somebody hasn't been doing the right thing and I think they've been staying in the situation that they're staying in, keeping to themselves, trying to restrain themselves, all the while knowing that, you know, this is coming. It's coming. And, you know, I... With the King of Pentacles here, this is, if I, it's like I'm throwing away abundance. I'm throwing away the golden opportunity in reverse. You know what I mean? The real golden opportunity. We're dealing with somebody here who is afraid of that. You know, I'm afraid of losing out, losing my, what I know, losing my money. Um, Having to pay child support, whatever it is, having to pay out, you know, somebody has probably been, or whatever it is, somebody has been afraid to, or hasn't found the courage to follow their heart because of money. That's what, that's exactly what this is, okay? But now they've come to the point where it's time to stand up. It's time to stand up for myself. Because now I see that I have a golden opportunity. Somebody is realizing or they're being offered a golden opportunity to find the abundance and to step out of this um, less than 
positive situation. You know, it's not positive. It's there's no growth. There's not even um, there's no passion. And you know, it's it's a lie. Somebody's living a lie with the justice reversed, and it's like I can't. You know, and holding it inside with the with the uh, keeping a secret. This has been a secret for quite some time. You know, but it but it's caused a lot of pain, and they've come to the point where I'm ready to to deal with this pain and I'm ready to heal. So it looks to me like somebody is um, finding the courage to follow their heart. The 24, somebody is finding the courage to follow their heart. Now let's get some, and you know, so this is a message, a message. So I mean, it, this could be somebody sending you a simple message like, you know, flirting. Um, and it's a welcome message, you know. It's it's something that is very playful and could lead to, well, let's see. What could it lead to? It could lead to something stable. It could. I mean, I don't even need to get it. it, it it's, that's what it could lead to. It could lead to the Ten of Pentacles. It really could. And the Ten of Pentacles is, is abundance. To build a new legacy in with somebody else. So that's what it could lead to. Well, I do see there could be a divorce though. Because there's no more. This spark is gone. It's gone. And you know. Somebody's intuition has been nudging them to go in a new direction. And it feels like they've been keeping it a secret and now they need to make that decision to or they are making it looks like they are making the decision to follow their heart mhm mm look at this express your love that's if somebody is that's exactly what this is the page of cups expresses his love so we have somebody here that is going to express their love let's get one more This is going over here. Remember what I said with this card? Do you remember what I said? I said, you know, somebody go down that road, you know, could get in, could lead to divorce. Remember I said that, you know, what I, when I said go down. This is like a very sexual energy, you know, whatever. Deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. And like I said, somebody was living a lie, keeping it to themselves. Probably more, both people, all three of them. It looks like there, I think there's a third party situation. We have a woman here, a man here, and a woman here. I mean, I don't know. So it looks like there was a third party situation in which now there could, and a third party doesn't mean that you actually even had sex with the person, even though it definitely could have happened. But I mean, it could mean sexting. That's a third party situation. Sexting. So I don't know. But it does look as though there, there could be some legal issues on, on the table or coming up because of deception, whether it, whoever it was, whether it was the man or the woman, whoever. Okay, and it could cost some money. But in the end, you're going to get a golden opportunity. It could absolutely cost some money because of this deception. But in the end, you find that you get that ten of pentacles. You get that abundance that you've been looking for. Somebody didn't act with integrity. They didn't make the right decision. They did the wrong thing. There's consequences for that. And now you got to own up to it. <laughs> and reveal the secret. Because... Keep holding on to a lie brings bad karma. I mean, the justice re reverse deception brings bad karma. And that's no lie. So, let's see. What else can we get here? I haven't used these in a while. Let's get one of these. Um, so, yeah, somebody is finding the courage to communicate. I mean, the night of... 
in the page, the knight, the knight of swords and the page of cups, somebody's fighting that sort of communication, okay? Somebody's finding the courage to communicate how they truly feel about following their heart. You know, this is no this is no longer abundant. There's no more passion. <sighs> it's time to be honest with it. Be honest. Time to be truthful. They may have a new love interest, a true love interest. You know what I mean? Show simple acts of kindness. A simple act of kindness can energize you and bring happiness to those around you. Be kind to yourself and everybody else by telling the truth. Romance. Lavish the one you love with your personal attention and affection. So yeah, I feel like the 24th is about somebody finding the courage. And look, I mean, I have to tell, I know a lot of people don't want to hear this, but I, I you know, I think, I think it's a man. Okay, I do. I think it's, I think it's the man that has, is going to do, be the one communicating. Because it's going to mess up a woman's independence. And his. Okay. Either way, could be either one. Uh, you know how I feel about women chasing, but whatever, you do whatever you want. Um, go ahead, make the romantic ge romantic gesture. That's what this is about. So, I think for the 24th, we are done. Talk to you next time.